Welcome to .NET Code Snippet with Error Code Solution. In this video section, I'm going to show you how to resolve the error. The name control name does not exist in the current context. Generally, this error occurs in normal running applications. Uh, let's see practically how we resolve this error. For that, I created an application. Controls one is uh, first name and last name, text box is two text box, one button control, one label here. I'm using here. I have the source code here, and I'm writing a logic for that button click. I'm writing a logic to display whatever data I entered in text boxes. Let's run this application and check if this is working or not. Uh, it's working as we expected. Uh, here you see I don't have any error here right now. Uh, till now we didn't find any errors here. Uh, I want to do some customization to get that error so let me I done some changes in the code so I get that error now we got that error here you see the name text to first name does not exist in the current content when I execute when I execute this it won't work properly maybe sometimes work work sometimes may not work but still you can see the error here in error box the name txt does not exist in the current context why we get this error generally when user copy the source code in the HTML and copy the source code and pasting into some other page without saving that directory they pull this application when we get this error because Whatever data we are dragging and dro dropping, so, so whatever data we are using, the data will be uh, created in the design page. Yeah, in this design page, whatever data controls are available, that will be available. We can access in code behind. Here you see, I have this txt text box control getting some error here. Let's see how to resolve that. In this design page, you can find this design page in under on dot ASPS page here just simply write this code here well, I comment that code that's why we get the error normally in real time this code will be erased we have to write manually from that error now we see I don't have any error here it's work as we expected like this video thanks for watching my video please subscribe my youtube channel to get more updates